Well, we can't thank you enough for the positive feedback, comments, and questions we're getting about the AMSOIL Tech Tip. So this one's for you. We got three more questions, Len, and man, who better to answer it than an expert? Len Chris from Burbank, California. He says, can I mix synthetic oil with conventional oil? I get that all the time. Yeah, we get that one as well. And at the end of the day, if it's an emergency and it's to get you out of some place, yes, you can do it. It won't create catastrophic damage, but we don't recommend it. We build synthetic oil with a you know very, very fine blend of additives and base oils. And when you throw a conventional in there, which is built completely differently, you can throw that mix all off and the longevity of the oil can be compromised. Man, now I can answer that question, thanks. How about Bruno from Elmhurst, Illinois? The prior owner ran synthetic oil and I'm now running conventional oil. Kind of what you just said, is that safe? You know what, it won't create catastrophic damage. There's no problems with that. There's a myth out there that says once you go to synthetic, you can never go back. That isn't true. The engine doesn't know the difference. As long as you're not mixing the two together, there's no issues. You can switch back and forth between synthetic and conventional. All right, one more question. Ryan from Boise, Idaho. I was told that synthetic oil can cause my engine to leak oil. Is that true? Well, I don't know the answer to that one. Well, is it the fault of the synthetic? No. However, in order to answer that properly, we have to be completely honest. Synthetic oil has a natural detergency. So if you have an engine that has a pile of miles on it and you put a synthetic in there, in certain situations that synthetic can go in there and clean all the dirt out that's actually holding the oil in uh, it, with a compromised seal, right? Hence high mileage oil. We put in seal conditioner, seal swell agents to help when it cleans it all out, the seals soften and swell, you don't have any leaks. So it's kind of an interesting question because synthetics get a bad rap. Do they cause it? Eh, not really. Awesome. Man, it's hard to believe it's been 52 tech tips. Thank you guys for the feedback. If you missed any of them, check them out on amsoil.com along with a whole line of awesome products.